It's gonna look a lot better than that. We waited a long time for an evolution- Oh my god. Dude, he's so cool. So do we like this one more than the other one? <laughs> yeah, I fucking love it. <laughs> I like this one more. I like it more. It's so good. So this is Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Um, oh god. So last time we played this, um, we combined a bunch of Pokemon together. And the game's really interesting. It has a bunch of custom sprites, and it also has just, you know, some things like this. So hopefully we can get some more fun new stuff today. Look at this, it's gonna be a Flarymander. Yay! <laughs> Dude, that's so cool. I love that one. We're also playing a Randomizer. Ooh, I wanna see what happens with execu Executes. Maybe, maybe we just play. I was expecting there to be like five gold bats. It was just one big gold bats are cute. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's our team right there. Our team is not final at all. Um, we have two badges. Uh, I guess we'll be taking on the SS and today and maybe Lieutenant Surge and whatever's afterwards. Um, so let's give that a shot. So we have a Gyarados Dragonite, which is pretty key here. Uh, Dragon Water type. And this is gonna be our special attacker, I believe, right? No, this is our physical attacker. Very slow, and he has a minus speed, so I don't know if this is the best thing to use, but whatever. Um, we also have Miss Maferno, which is a Monferno Miss Magius. I don't know if we're going to use this. It will eventually be an Infernape, so that's cool. We have Darkrai, which is actually two Darkrais put together to make an even cooler looking Darkrai. But I don't know if we're going to use this too much because we have Dark Tay, which is Darkrai and Entei put together. And I think this thing looks incredible. We also have a good nature on it. I would be shocked if this thing isn't on our team for the long run, just because it's so goddamn cool. But I, who knows? We might actually ditch this dude today. It's possible. Um, this is one of the coolest looking Pokemon I've ever seen. It's just incredible. Uh, we also have Gangmillion, which will hopefully evolve today. This looks really bad now, but eventually this game, I would be shocked if they don't have a custom sprite for a Charizard Gengar combination. So, while this sucks right now, we have the XP share on it, and hopefully it becomes something cool in the future. We also have Dragoras, which is half Dragonite and half Lapras. So we have double Darkrai and double Dragonite on the team, so we'll hopefully uh, figure out all that. But we could have a Genizard soon, or a uh, Charagar at some point. So there's lots of stuff to look forward to, and also insane combinations. Like, if there's a Pokemon you love, you could put another Pokemon with a better, na or with a better ability on it. Like... There's a lot of stuff we can look at. Anything with Mimikyu's adorable? Doesn't surprise me. I draw my pickaxe, now I can't get to it. It's all the way over there behind these rocks. I got you, bro. Really? I'm just gonna speed the game up really fast. Oh, there's Pokemon to fight. And we got another Glyph. Oh, that's Gibble and Growlithe put together. So that would be a Garchomp Arcanine when it was fully evolved. We got the pickaxe. Sharp tool that can be used to break rocks without the use of an HM. Okay. So, Rock Smash is kind of pointless now. That's nice. Oh, there's one other thing I was told to do that would make my life easier. So, let me go figure out what that is real quick. Go to Route 2 and enter the house that has trees in the backyard. Oh, Jesus Christ. Guess we need to cut all those later when we have cut, is that what you mean? Uh, I was away for some time and the trees have grown all over my garden during my absence. I would have cut them down, but I'm still a youngster like you, but alas, I'm an old man or something like that. Alright, so I need to cut down all those trees. I don't have cut yet, so we'll come back and do that later. So it seems like they got rid of um, HM, so you don't need to have an HM person. So, I guess once you get each HM, you do the task associated with it, and you get a, re get a way to not have to do it, which is really nice. So we'll come back once we have that. So the pickaxe will be Rock Smash, and we'll probably get like a garden hedges, or um, some garden clippers for the hedges. That'd be nice. My friend was supposed to meet me here, but he's running late so that he might just miss the ship. I, on the other hand, never miss anything thanks to the Pokemon move called Swift. 
Fuck off, dude. Jesus Christ. Hollywood Boulevard all over, all over again, chat. Would you like my mixtape? Did you know SS Anne only comes once a year? So does Santa Claus's wife, since he always neglects her. Looks like you have a ticket. You can board the ship. Thanks. Hello, welcome to SS Anne. May I see your ticket? Your room is room number two. Bet. What's up, old man? Let's battle. Bum, 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 bum. And he's got a gog Ralph. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, that's a golem and a Tangrith, right? Jesus. That's, that's disgusting. All right, we're kind of leaving Dragon Rage territory, but it's it seems like we can still two-shot most things, which will be nice. And we can at least do that until we get some good physical moves on our uh, Dragados. Or some special moves on our Chargar. So we still have no special moves on that Chargar that are worth it. We need, like, Shadow uh, Ball and Flamethrower or something. This is my room, right? Also, is it worth it to check the trash cans? Yeah, it looks like it is. Right, I'm not going to go back to the first room for the trash can, but we will check that one. And Vaporeon Gamble, thank you for the nine months. Is that when you were uh, combining a Vaporeon and a Gamble together? Oh, jeez, Eiffel Tower. Dumpster diving for the win, you know it. I mean, if someone's going to put a super potion in the ice, uh, in the thing, you might as well grab it. Wait. Latta Fable, wow. Okay, so we need to change our team up. We're not set up for a double battle. We have the wrong Pokemon in right now. This Shroom Egg should get fucked up. That's a lad Latius and a fucking... Oh, God. Oh, wait, that would be a Water type. That sucks. God, I hate double battles so much. Dude, Dark Darktay just looks like a stud in there, bro. We got a Ghastly with a... Magnezone? Wait, no, dude, that's sick. That's a Gengar? Magnezone? And then it puts a few Ghastlies on him? Dude, that thing's fucking sick. Kind of reminds me of um, Dragapult with the two kids on his shoulder. Crazy shit, bro. Hey, he should be weak to this, right? Steel type? I guess not. It's tough, because, like, let's say a two-type Pokemon combines with another two-type Pokemon. You don't always know what type they're going to be. Nothing but trash. I never saw you at the party. Last on um, with a bubble it. Golet and Bulbasaur together. Holy shit, that's ugly. Forearms bigger than the head, bruh. I really love Dragon Rage, don't I? <laughs> Area Palm. Area does and Ambi Palm together, probably? Or A Palm? Um, no. <laughs> Poor thing, bro. Why he look like that? <laughs> I just love seeing the stupid Pokemon together. I don't even care if we ever beat this game. I just think it's so funny to see all the dumbassery together. Did I skip door number three? I did. I got confused. <laughs> Firo and Porygon together? <laughs> oh, we're gonna have so much fun. Dude, wait till we have like a massive Pokédex of like... Wait till, wait till my PC is full of like even a hundred Pokémon. We're gonna have so many options. It's, it's just gonna be in... Stop it! It's just gonna be insane. Dark Onyx, right? No. Dude, that's Darkrai and Jinx together, right? Is that what that is? Dude, that's like a super, like, edgy Darkrai. That's so cool. I think that's Jinx. Yeah, that makes sense with the NX. Yo, stop slapping me. Goth girlfriend Pokemon, bro. What do you want? I always travel with my Clefable. And we got Galvaking coming in. That's a probably a, like a slow king with a Galvantula. It's gonna be sick. No, it's slacking Galvantula. It's Galvantula paint me like your French girls. <laughs> oh shit, that's funny to me. 
<laughs> oh, this game's so fucking good. We're only two badges in and it's this good. Wait till we have all the, like, the final evolution Pokemons to get some crazy, like, custom sprites. What a king! Dude, the fact that this game, battling, like, mundane-ass trainers while in the SSN is entertaining. Like, that's so nice. Everything's fun. What you got, bro? A Whaleloom. Okay, that one kind of sucks. <laughs> Whalemer and Gloom together. Not the best. And a Mantle. <laughs> that's Grottle and Mantine? <laughs> or Mantike? Is that Mantike or Mantine? Probably Mantike. Um, that's fucking funny. Agte. So an Entei and Agron combo? Holy shit. I got that right. Look at his Agron face, dude. It's like, honestly, not horrible. It could be better, but it works. All right, what you got? Great balls. You do have great balls, my good sir. All right, we roll. The feats are weird. Paris, Paris. I spent all my savings to buy for this cruise. It's completely worth it. Wait. Yeah, I was gonna say, if there's a room where there's no battle, there's definitely something in the, in the trash can. That's weird to walk into some lady's room, talk to her, and that, this is gonna be a double battle, right? Doesn't have to be. Sorry, I'm not Whoopi Glick, guys. I'm not doing double battles. Oh, God! A Magby Hopip? I'm out of PP? Dick don't work, bro. Alright, Zorua and Krabby? <laughs> okay, that's like kinda cute. If you if you make his face nicer, his face is a little blurry. But besides the face, it's not that bad. And a Turtwig Mantike or Mantine. Um Not ideal. <laughs> Max Ether. All right, so there's no point to come down here. That's good. All right, so let's go down first, then we'll go up. Sniff, sniff, I only get to peel onions. What do you got to say, sir? I am Le Chef. Oh, you're looking for the leftover crabby legs. Sure, just go ask the lady by the stoves. I'm sure we have some leftovers. Oh, that's for a side quest, right? Yeah. All right, that would be this woman. And we get some crabby legs just casually entering the kitchen. So there was someone who had a side quest where they wanted some of that, so that's good. Why is there a timer? Oh, there's a fucking bomb, dude. I don't get this. I don't understand the timer. What'd you say? Okay. I don't know what happened. I didn't read what the text block was, but whatever. Alright, let's see what's in here. Another big room. Oh, I'm sorry. The restaurant's full at the moment. You'll have to come back later if you want to eat here. I'm staying. I don't want to fucking steal, dude. Are you kidding me? Alright, we got some pussies playing music because they have no other personality traits. Teach you hyper voice for 4,000. Okay. Crab legs ain't fresh no more. Don't care about your fossils. Fuck you guys. What do you got? You're gonna need a coin case if you wanna play here. Yo, they put casinos back in the Pokemon games. Alright, I'm sure we missed something here, but that's fine. And then there was also a way to go this way. Let's see what that is. That'd be an additional few rooms. Let's clear them. Kid got sick. And he puked in the trash can. Bad idea for me. 
Nothing but trash. Oh god, is that Bonsley and Monferno together? That's horrible. That might be one of the worst ones we've seen. <laughs> it's really bad. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what happened with the crab legs thing, but we're just not doing it anymore. I don't care about side quest. I'm over it. I don't care what item we get. I'm out. I do want to put some... I want to put him a champ with a few things. I think that'd be fun. And we got a Tanron. That's an Aaron Tangela or Tangrowth. <laughs> Rye Peter. Hey, Peter. Rhyperion and Executor, bro. That's sick. Alright, our Dragados might die here. Yeah, that's a shame. Um, do we have a Poison Heal? We have an Antidote. That might work. There we go. Oh, I don't care if Dragados dies, though. It's not a Nuzlocke. <laughs> we'll just kill it. Oh, these two are sucking face. Ew! Alright, I'll go back to get our viewer count up, I guess. That's so fucking hot. I bet this guy's a Latios. Dude! That's fucking sick. <laughs> you said the old guy had a Pokeball I missed? Yeah, you're right. Thank you. Quick break. Anything over yonder? Check out what I fished up. What did you fish up? You fished up a toaster bath. Alright, that's an elect elegant with a Meryl. Bonk. I just love the thrash animation. Just smack it a few. <laughs> <laughs> Please get off the screen. <laughs> Need a pip. Oh, dude, being locked into thrash kind of sucks because I don't really get a. I, I lose control over the game at that point because it just locks into the hit. So we don't really get to look at the Pokemon too much. If it's funny. Captain's keys. Alright, we got the captain's keys. I would imagine that's what we're looking for here. Yeah. I might go back for a real quick Dragon Rage reset. I got lost, I'm sorry. Oh wait, that's right here. Sorry to be such a slut for Dragon Rage, but it's working for me, you know? Bonjour, Speedy. Oh! It's our rival, right? Oh, good thing I healed. Alright, so our rival has some pretty unfortunate Poke- Pretty unfortunate looking Pokemon. This one being maybe one of the most. My dude turned big head mode on, bro. Alright, King 2. So this is his uh This is his Ditto Kingdra, which is so stupid looking. Um so we'll stay in against it. That's so unfortunate for him. <laughs> King 2 is your favorite? I just think it's so funny how we started the game with a Hitmonchan Entei, and he gets a Ditto Kingdra. That's so sad for him. Uh, Pawnee. Oh, by the way, chat, what gen does this go up to? Because, obviously, I haven't seen a single Gen 8 or Gen 9 Pokemon. Does it go up to 7, or where does this go up to? It goes only to Gen 5? Or 7? Because, like, dude, I'm kind of sad that we can't, like, turn Dragapult and, like, Palma and all the new people into things. Goes up to 6? Okay, everyone's giving different answers, so I'm not going to trust any of you. Ponyard and Steeny? What the fuck is the knee from? Is that Steeny? Oh, Cottony, that makes sense. I don't know why that's not working, but I'm not gonna read. Bonk. Dude, not cool. Is that a Weedle Kyogre? <laughs> it's a Weedle. That is a Weedle, right? What is that where the duel comes from? That's so funny. Oh, Wurmple. Yeah, it's probably Wurmple, right? It doesn't look like a Weedle in the legs, right? Maybe it's... I have no clue. Either way, that's fucking hilarious. Poor guy. Yeah, I think it's a Weedle. Swaddle? It's bad. 
But he does have a Kyogre. That's interesting. Super Potion. Bonk. Yeah, I think it's Weedle. I, I'm trusting my first one on that one because the DLE. Alright, there's a Cutmaster on board. He's just a seasick old man, but Cut is useful. I'm gonna go now. Alright, so let's go get Cut. A little bit of a rap god there. We'll recover. I unlock the door. Oh, I feel hideous. Seasick. Rub a dub dub. Speedy rub the captain's back. Thank you, I feel so much better. You want to see my cut technique? I could show you if I wasn't so ill. I'm so goddamn trill. Can I leave yet? Are we good? Is that all we needed to do? I forget everything about Kanto. I've only played it 55 times. How do I not remember everything? Oh, I get it. I got this chat. Hold on. Are you not able to get more? I need to go tell them that they're not fresh, and then I can do that again? Oh, they're a bit cold. I know there's a lot to ask. Would you mind bringing some that are still warm? Okay, this guy's a giant fucking pussy. That's fine, though. We'll go get him some warm crab legs. I'm pretty sure I can run this in 20 seconds. I'm pretty goddamn fast, dude. I actually don't lose stamina when I run. That's how fast I am. We zoom in! Oh, fuck. Jesus Christ, dude. One second on the clock? That's a little rough, bro. Alright, so he'll teach Crab Hammer to something if I need Crab Hammer. Wait. I think this guy gives me something now, right? More people want to give me something. Wait. Alright, let's get our third gym badge. Lieutenant Surge. Let's do this. Now this gym is notorious for being maybe one of the best puzzles in the history of Pokemon. Yo, what's up, champ? What do you say? Is flying Pokemon? I don't think it matters though since randomizer. Dude, Galvantula and Aerodactyl together kind of fucks. That's pretty goddamn cool. Gentleman Tucker. That's a great name, dude. Gentleman Tucker. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with flying Pokemon. Our first look at any Dodrio combos. This one, an Alakadrio. <laughs> oh man, that's bad. He's sending in a Shrello. Oh, I'm frozen. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, I'm unfrozen. I think we're good. No place for kids. And we get Zwellius with Aerodactyl this time. That'd be Ice Fang. That's actually quad weak to Ice, right? Stop making me fucking flinch, bro. Okay, um, I'm just gonna go heal real quick. Also, I don't know how much PP Ice Fang has. I didn't check, but I'm probably fine. Heal. I guess we need Surf to get to that? 
Wait. No. No backyard. Okay. We'll wait till we have surf. Let me start moving at normal speed. There's a button on the trash can. Chat, did I just like Giga Brain get really like lucky on that? Am I a fucking god? Like that's an RNG god right there, right? That's pretty goddamn impressive if you know how that gym works. Great job me, here's a W. Alright, Lieutenant Surge. What you got? I'll tell you, kid, a flying Pokemon saved me during the war. It pecked my enemies into paralysis. The same thing as I'll do to you, brother. I'm using three Pokemon for this battle, so choose the ones you're gonna use there, Squirt. Dragados, I choose you. Dark Tag, I choose you. And Gangmillion, now level 30, I choose you. Okay? Oh, okay. There's an odd pause there. Why is his name Dragados? He's half Dragonite, half Gyarados, Platy. What do you mean? Ew! <laughs> doinks! <laughs> Dude, why does the gym leader have a doinks, bro? Look at that thing. Look at that motherfucker. Looks dumb as shit, bro. Why, why he look like that? Catch this fuck face. <laughs> doinks. He was sending in a Slaffery, which is probably a Slay King with a Butterfree. So it should be half lazy, 100% and then half Butterfree. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. My mans don't even have wings no more. Why'd they take his wings away? Why couldn't it keep its wings? Oh, Lieutenant Surge. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, Lieutenant Surge ripped its wings off, bro. He pulled the Pixelmon Speedy Special. I'm notorious for ripping the wings off. I might Dragon Rage here. Just get the 40 no matter what. My dude ate a fucking coconut! Lieutenant <laughs> Surge, oh my god, bloody. <laughs> oh shit. Bro, stop healing! He took it behind the Bro! center. Bro! If thing's already dead, you ripped its wings off. Why are you healing it? What? Yeah, that's a rather odd tyke. You aren't wrong. <laughs> dude, what is this dude's Pokemon, man? <laughs> oh, sh no, I don't, I'll handle it. It's fine. I can't believe this dude's Pokemon, man. All right, that was the funniest gym battle I've ever had. I can't believe the three shitters he just threw out there. But he's fucking jacked. Look at those cum gutters. <laughs> he was ready for battle. The Thunder Badge. Cranks up your Pokemon's speed. It's American made. Fix or repair daily. Forward. TM73 Thunder Wave. Yes, please. You're, spe you're a special kid. And I mean that in the good kind of way. What's the bad kind of way, Lieutenant Search? Dare you to tweet it. Lieutenant Search trying to get canceled, brother. Good job, Miss Monferno. Oh, hello there, are you a Pokemon trainer? I work at the Pokemon Museum in Pewter City. I just wanted to let you know that the state-of-the-art fossils are rev reviving machine is now operating again. Come visit if you have any fossils to revive. Here, take this. It'll help you get around. Teleport. I'm just gonna make Miss Maferno here our HM person. Um, I'm not gonna use the thing. We can always reteach it moves in the future.
This game has Johto? I'm pretty sure this game's only only done through the first eight gyms so far, though. I might be wrong on that. Alright, I do want to go back to Cerulean for a few seconds, though. Wicked. I might be wrong. When I went to download this, it said that they have the story done through eight gyms so far. So we'll see. But that means we can always come back in the future and do Johto or whatever else afterwards, you know? I still don't have strength, so we can't get to that. We haven't even really done any fusing today yet, which is pretty interesting. Wasn't there a cut spot up here? I swear there was. Yeah, I knew there was. A lame charge. Alright, let's see if we can revive a fossil. I imagine that's not done there. Maybe I should talk to this lady? Oh, there's a whole nother room. Oh, now. Dome fossil. Come back around 8 o'clock. It should be ready. I bet. I disagree with how that door worked. What are these quests again? Three tiny mushrooms. Brilliant forest. Fully evolved bug. I don't think I have that. And I did this, kids. The quest, so we're good. We good to go, bruh. And that should have accelerated the clock enough to get this one done. That's not the museum. You stupid idiot. So it's still just a Kabuto? You can keep it. Thought maybe it'd be a randomized Pokemon, so you, you can just you can just keep it. It's fine. Alright, this might be a little annoying, but we do need to get um the shears so we don't have to use cut anymore. Deforestation's cool. We gotta reverse everything Mr. Beast did. Get rid of them trees, brother. Lemonade! You expected a bit more? Here's some shears. Gay. Okay, cool. So now we don't need to use a Pokemon to cut things, which is very nice. I think we still will in the interim until we put that one away. But I would imagine in the future, if we don't have a Pokemon to cut, that will just happen. I'm trying to think of other cut spots there is. Um, I think there's one right by Cerulean and then we can continue. Yeah, there is one right by Cerulean. Yeah, would Kabuto really be a Kabuto? Is that worth checking? That was a cut item right there. Let me grab that. I think it will be a Kabuto because it's it's like the... I think it's going to be a Kabuto. Waterstone. We can get a... We have an Eevee. We have a Baneary. I'm just saying, chat. Low Pony Vaporeon could be the most breedable Pokemon of all time. Does, has anyone ever heard of copy pasta about that? I swear, one time I heard like some quirky cost copy pasta about that chat. Might be something we can look into. I'm the daycare man. I'll help the take your poke, throw them all the shawl, that shit, brother. Get in, fucking get in there and do it, brother. All right, sweet. What should we put into the daycare chat? Should we even deal with this? Do we care about anything that we have? I don't know if we do. I think we'll just leave it. Bug it. Go upstairs in it. Chase day in it. I still can't believe that Lieutenant Surge battle. That was so funny. What the hell was he doing, bro? I didn't realize we could go in here. Wave incense. Someone abandoned this egg here. 
Poor thing, would you mind taking care of it? I wonder if it, what's going to get crapped out of that egg. Destiny cannot. Alright, I think that will make our egg hatch. I'm hoping this is random, but it could just be a butthole Tokopi. That would kind of suck. If it is, we'll just get rid of it, but yeah. Oh yeah, I think I have to go get a bicycle. Here's your bike, fuckface. How do you register something? And then what's the muscle for it? Oh, dude, that's incredible. God, this game's pretty well thought out. Cool. Let's see what new Pokemon await us in this round. Alright, let's hope that we don't need Flame Body to be in the first slot. Uh, we're probably getting really close to a Gen Million uh, evolution. We didn't catch much today. We actually caught zero Pokemon today. So we'll catch some new stuff on this route and we'll see what we got. You do not need Flame Body in the first slot, I promise. Okay, cool. We're good to go then. Picnicker. Dude, I am so, so curious to see what every Pokemon looks like turned into an evolution. This is awesome. It's... I kind of like that. It was like creepy cute. Uh, we have a Chikorita and a Gabite, probably. Yep. And a Skipmar. Is that a Malamar that's Skiploom? No, Magmar and a Skiploom. Yuck. What's that cute looking Pokemon at the top left? What fusion is it? Are you trying to talk about me? Bro, please tell me the fu- Please tell me you're not trying to talk about me in the top right. Mr. Woofy, did you get your left and right confused? Were you- were you trying to talk- you can just write in a chat, just say, yeah, I'm sorry, I messed up. You were trying to call me a cute Pokemon, weren't you? And you fucked up mightily, didn't you? Hey. I got you. It was always me, bro. It was always me. Alright, let me make sure this thing doesn't breathe anymore. Bonk, bonk, bonk. We're a little over-leveled right now. I'm not too worried about that, though, because... Honestly, the only two Pokemon I see sticking around for the foreseeable future are Dragados and, and you know, Darktay and... Chargar. Those are, like, the three I like the most right now. Other than that, we have a little redundancy on our team. Looks like he's sticking his head through a portal. What you doing? Rhydon? Rhytom. This game, bro, is so good. It's so goddamn good. Whoever's idea this was and whoever executed it so beautifully, they're geniuses. I don't necessarily know who made this. I wish I could credit them better. I probably could figure that out. Um, we have a slow arena, which is a neat arena with a slow poke. Yep. And dude, honestly, that thing's fucking awesome. We also have rare candies if we want to expedite our uh, our Chargar. Because honestly, Dark Cry needs some XP. Alright, once he gets his next level, I'm just going to throw two rare candies on him. That way we're not wasting that half XP bar. Cool. And then we can finally catch some Pokemon up there. I see the grass. I'm taking Rock Tunnel to go to Lavender Town. Streamer got fused with pale and girl voice to create flashbang. You're not wrong. We have a Rotom... Registeel. Or Regigigas, I guess? Yeah, it's Regigigas. Holy fuck. Luckily, it seems like we're still in two-shot uh, Dragon Rage distance, so I'm not too mad about that. Hey, yeah, it's kind of cool. I like the little guy. I'm not a big Rotom fan, but, like, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Camper Chris is about to send in... Yeesh!
That's a... That's a Yanma... Or... What's the little fucker's name? And Shroomish? Jesus. Yamas, that's it. Yikes. Should be weak to fire though, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Alright, what's... She turned downwards? Yeah, Dark Day's sick. Like, uh, black and red just always look... Whoa. And Polion and Heracross? Yeah, the face could have been better, but yeah. Um, uh, we got Lop Portal. <laughs> Alright, we have not found anything in this route yet. This should be something new. That's a little disappointing. It's gonna be a Dusclops and Ursa Ring are our options if we evolve it. That's gonna be a soft cock for me. I think I'm out. Could you fuse Lepunny and Gardevoir? You sure can. For sidearms, definitely not me, ha ha. That would be weird. Yeah, that would be a little weird if it was from you, but yeah, um, yeah, you can. And we probably will at some point. So all the team, uh, town names are after colors? I'm starting to think so, my dude. We got Vermilion and Cerulean and Pewter and, um, the palette might be what all the colors are on, if you really think about it. And Lavender and Fuchsia? Saffron? It's starting to, it's starting to make me wonder, you know? Are those all just colors? Yo, why he look like that, bruh? Exodile! This could be fun. It Executes are always going to be funny because there's six of them. Oh. Oh, no. Never mind. Never mind, indeed. Yo, why he look like that, bruh? Johnny Sins, bruh. Uh, we got Scyther and Excadrill, probably? No, Beedrill and Scyther. <laughs> oh, it's crazy how many Pokemon have the, the same suffix or prefix to their names, dude. It's, it's fun trying to predict them and then just being so goddamn wrong. Uh, Scyther's one of my favorites. Beedrill, one of my favorites. Those two together? Not interested. Um, Wigglybuff and Wailord or Whalmer. If this is Wailord and Igglybuff, this could be a monstrosity. Prepare yourself. Never mind. <laughs> it's Thanos. <laughs> oh, I love this game. Did I fight this wonderful woman up here? No, I didn't. Oh. Let's kill it so it's not in pain anymore. And we got a Grybro. Grimer and Slowbro? <laughs> Piplup and Hapini? <laughs> Would Panseer and Hapini be Panini? Dude, honestly, maybe. Any of the pans, I guess, but yeah. Yeah, I also need the steps anyway for the egg, so it's fine. Good, good point. I should stop bitching about the backtracking. It's good for us. We got a Marsh Stomp and a Porygon 2. Yikes. 120 base damage with my attack stats actually pretty fucks. I just don't love using Thrash because then we don't get to look at the Pokemon too long. I'm also speeding the game up, so maybe it's me. Rare Candy! How bad do we want a Gangmelion? Because I think we're one level away now if we want to rush it. Yeah, let's do that. Come on, dude, he says. Panpour plus Stratini would also be Panini. So many sandwiches! Ponchberry. Venerian Honchcrow, that's a yikes. It should be fucked by ice, though. And we have a Manion, which is a Mantike Flareon or some shit, maybe? No, Sylveon Mantike? <laughs> Bro. Talonflame Mankey. And I'm happy to tell you it's off your screen now, chat. That was a monstrosity. That was something I would draw in that drawing game back in the day. Alright, one, one more trainer here. My Pokemon will get tougher and tougher. She says with her... <coughs> Bro. <laughs> it's a fucking Zapdos with a curly ahead. 
That's so bad. Looks like she beat us to the power plant, though. Uh, Jamelia wants to learn... Sh oh, this is perfect. Alright, let's have some fun, chat. This We might be a little over-leveled. It might be what it is, but um, I think it's time. This is also a little lazy. You know, we could, we could wait a few seconds, but we should be able to give this guy three rare candies and see a rather interesting evolution. Chat, feast your eyes on... Gengar Charizard combined. It's gonna look a lot better than that. We waited a long time for an evolution. Oh my god. Dude. He's so cool. He's so cool. Wing attack. You don't get that, bro, okay? Stop it. Get some help. Shadow Punch. I just got rid of that, my guy. Okay? You are a special attacker. Stop it. My dude's got some big teeth. Dragon Rage. Yo, that's my shit, bro. I love Dragon Rage. Did you guys know I like Dragon Rage? You guys ever seen me use Dragon Rage before? It's a pretty cool move. All right. Now we save the save file B. And for those who do not know, right now, he's mostly Charizard but a little Gengar. But we can make that... We can see what he'd look like if he's more Gengar and less Charizard. So let's do that. So do we like this one more than the other one? <laughs> yeah, I fucking love it. <laughs> what a moment. <laughs> Make it a moment. I don't care. I like this one more. I like it more. It's so good. It's so good, chat. Stop saying you hate it. It's so good. Oh, it's got that it factor. Oh, it's just fantastic. Bro, how many times do I have to tell you not to learn Shadow Punch? Or Wing Attack. Stop it. Chat, we can always turn it back for $300. Alright, so Dark Tay's gonna eat the XP share for now. And we're going to... Oh, it's so good. Look how cool he is, bro. Look how cool he is. Bro got a horse cock for a nose. <laughs> All right, so I want to see him in battle real quick. This egg's being a little uh, a little late, but that's fine. We're at level 36. We're a little over ba uh, over leveled, so we, maybe we'll uh, shelf him for a bit. But he is usable. He has a fire and a, sh uh, a ghost move now. Let me make sure he's still a super strong physical attacker. That didn't mess, an mess anything up, did it? Or a special attacker. Dude, look at those stats. 91 speed, 105 special attack. This guy's going to slap, dude. Good nature. Bro looks and he's like got a levitate. Creeping at the bar. Yeah, I know, dude. This dude's the type of dude, 2 a.m. at the bar, hover hand, bro. I mean, uh, hovering. You know, not the hover hand. Sorry, there's a difference between hovering and hover hand. All right, I'm glad we got this evolution finally. What a treat. Let's see him in battle. <laughs> Oval stone. Alright, it's time, chat. This might not be the best matchup, as we have a Mawile and a Lapras. <laughs> he just side-eyes everything. Oh, it's so good. Don't you just hate it when you come home and Chargar's fucking your wife? Nice, dude. Ice Shard, that was really smart. Also, chat, we might do the thing where, like, this stream we use Chargar looking like that. Maybe next stream we change him so he's more... Uh, the purple one, you know? We can always switch it up. I can't get past its eyebrows. Looks like a butt above its eyes. Are you talking about me? I'm joking. Alright, what do we got down here? Huh? <laughs> it's so sad! <laughs> it's so sad! 
Oh, that's fucking funny, bro. Actually, that was a bad idea to use that, but it's fine at this level. We're so overleveled. I need to calm down. Let me see what else spawns here. We don't have Surf yet, so... We get a Dragonite Miss Magius again. I might catch this. I want to know what it looks like when you, you put two Dragonites together. Catch gotcha, it, bitch. Alright, so we're going to rip the Dragonite out of that, and then let's just go fuse two Dragonites together. Let me see if I can find another Miss Manite. Poor thing. God, you're so cute, though. I just want to see what it looks like. We we're not going to use it. We don't need uh, too much, but we haven't done any fusing today. Also, I'm pretty sure later we'll get um, some better items based on how many Pokemon we fuse together, so we might as well get that number up. All right, let's do our first fusion of the day. You think I can sneak in the power plant? Wow. I guess we're not really sneaking in. I guess this is just how you get down here. I thought that was a solid structure right there, but I guess it obviously now that I know what it looks like, doesn't look like that. Huh? Oh, I thought they were going to give me a Pokemon Center rival battle for no reason. Not a big Togepi fan, but I'm sure we can make a monstrosity with it. So we'll let's, let's keep it for now. That will clear up some space in the... Dude, honestly, we could, we could put a Dragonite inside of a big Poke, uh, Togepi egg. So there's like a Dragonite coming out of the Togepi egg. It could be pretty cute. Oh, there's so many options. I guess no matter what, it looks the same, right? Yeah. Dude, this thing's gonna be nuts. What's it gonna be? I did not expect three heads. I only put two of them together. Holy shit. It can circle the globe in just 16 hours. Yuck, round earthers. It is a kind-hearted Pokemon that leads lost and found... Oh, we already read this. It didn't change its thing, I guess. Okay, I might not use this. I'm just glad we got to see what it looked like, because we already have a Dragonite on the team. But, dude, that makes me want to fuse a lot of the same Pokemons together to make some crazy shit. Oh my god. What? Is that its asshole and it's spreading it? Or what's going on there? I don't get it. I guess this is what we're supposed to do next. I'm not mad about this. Fuck, I got baited. I played this as a kid. How'd I not remember? Charge beam. Might have to put a repel on at some point, because I think we're going to be seeing a lot of this. But there's also the chance of something else. We also don't know what Electrode is, but I would imagine Azumite is just the Voltorb of this area. I think that's how the randomizers work. Thunderstone, that's a big deal. So now we have a Jolteon possibility. Um, because we have the... Right, so that kind of confirms that Voltorb is Azuril, right? Is that what's going on here? I think that's how randomizers work, I'm pretty sure. Let me buy more repels. Pits! I already forgot. I legit did not think in a million years that that was not going to be the battle. Fish brain memory. Oh, sweet. Take a penny, leave a penny. The gate won't open. Bro, I don't even see a gate. Fuck you. Dad, how do I open the gate? Stand in front of the gate and say cock? Okay, I got you. Cock. Didn't work. All right, I guess we have to leave. Just battle her. And we got the beauty with a Lucario Rotom, which looks horrible. I'll say it, just, just miserable. And we get a Spearyard. So this is a Spearow Ponyard. <laughs> it's ribcage. 
Oh no, kill it. Please kill it. Die. Oh, I should use the fire move. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. So bad, dude. Defense is the best offense. Iron defense, no. Offense is the best offense. No. Okay, guess we'll go into here. Do we have flash yet? See, puppy. Not bad. When I was a kid, I brute forced my way through this because I didn't know how to get flash, so I just, like, pushed against the walls till I finally made it out of there. It took me, like, five hours. I was such a little shitter as a kid. She can ride. Same. What the fuck is this? A Rotom Electrode? Is this a Rotom Electrode? Road? Am I battling a trainer? Can I catch this? I'll catch the next one. Oh, this is a trainer. Okay. Clanmar. Cling Clang and Magmar? I got gears on my face. And Palicious Dussy. Thanks for the 17 months. Palicious Dussy. It's one leg, Greg! It's one leg, Greg! Is there anything good in these? Oh my god. It's a baby Umbreon! It's a baby Umbreon, are you kidding me? That thing is adorable. So is that, well, what is this? What's the V from? Is that an Umbreon with an EV making it a smaller Umbreon? I'm pretty sure it is, right? That is fucking precious. Oh, I can't wait to rip the Umbreon out of it and make it even cuter, or make it a monstrosity or something else. Yay. Evolution Moonlight Pokemon. That's incredible, dude. dude this game's incredible. Let's do duo with a Ghastly. It's just so goddamn good. Oh. Oh, it keeps KYRing itself, bro. That's the, s the third time one of these things KYR'd itself. I want to see what Gengar and Gengar look like together. But the snake box keep KYRing. Alright, sorry for the backtrack McGizak here, but, um... I forgot we had a few things. And it seems like Eevees are not going to be hard to get. I've been told Eevee plus Eevee is adorable. I don't know if we'll do that right now. But, there's a certain type of Pokemon we do not have yet. And let's combine a few things together and see what our best options are. We have a water type already, so I know you guys love how breedable a Vaporeon possibly could be. But we're going to be getting a Butthole Jolteon. So we don't have an electric type yet. We could see what an... We could even see what an Umbreon with a Butthole Jolteon would look like. So that's what it looks like when you combine a stone with an Eevee. Thundershock. Yeah, we can always get more Eevees, so this is fine. Um, let's... We could even Toaster Bath this thing. We could do a Jolteon-Vaporeon combo. And call it Toaster Bath. So many options. Do we want to take the Eevee out of this Umbreon and see what an Umbreon Jolteon looks like together? Let me save. We have too many options. And once again, don't ever, like, get too attached to these. Because, like, I've said this before. 
If we want to take the Dragonite and Gyarados off of this thing, we can rip them apart and we'll still have them. So like, it's really cool that you can do that. So like, even if we have something, we can always just rip it out of there. Nothing's like permanent. All right, Eevee plus Eevee. I just need to know. A lot of people told me this is really cute. It's okay. All right, we have two Eevees. Uh, this honestly just saves space in the box, so we'll put it there. We can always rip them apart later for $300. I'm not going to reset the save state on this. I will actually reset this save state, though. So let me get out of here. They're both custom. Let me go with the left one to start with. Stop! I kind of like it. <laughs> so this would give us two dark types on our team, though. Um, Umbreon evolved from exposure to the moon's energy pulse. It looks like it just takes both the things together there. There they are. Do I like that more? Chat, do you like that more or less? <laughs> I, I feel like there's parts of it I like, but parts I don't like. Both are bad. They were both bad. I will right, we'll keep it like that for now. Um, once again, I think I'm just going to rip them apart later and see what Umbreon combines with better. Um, so I think that's fine. Uh, let me just look at him real quick, because that's going to be a special attacker, right? There's no way it's not. Yeah, special attack, good speed, synchronize. Yeah, it kind of sucks, but at least we have an electric-type move now if we need it in the future. Dragoras is still overstaying his welcome. All right, let's continue. We need to buy a fuck ton of those. Regular repels aren't going to get us far. And Nightwing, thank you so much. I thought he was the Pokemon for a second. Uh, we have a Bliss Knot, which is a Blissy Why Not? Dumb fuck Shadow Ball maneuver, dude. Oh, and now we're getting evaded. Oh, horrible move choice. Oh. Oh, it's so bad. All right, time to speed this up. We're never going to hit it. Did I get destiny bonded? Thank you. Slowbull. <laughs> I think we got destiny bonded. I'm not sure, so we should probably pull out. And that doesn't attack either, so we got even more. I think we're going to be here for a while. I can't be too mad at him. This is a strategy I uh, use against sidearms sometimes whenever I'm too lazy to figure out how to win a, win a match. This is a really annoying Pokemon to fight. I genuinely don't think this is gonna end. This is really- I might even reset the save to run by him. He is impossible to kill. He has like a plus 32 evasion, plus he's gonna softball anytime I hit him. We're actually fucked. Can I not Thunder Wave it? Look at that evasion, that's insane. So I'm hoping he might be paralyzed whenever he's- he tries to use his, uh, we're out of Dragon Rages, that's great. Yeah, this was, I should have bought Swift from that guy, that would be the only reason for that shit. Perfect. Get fucked. Jesus Christ, dude. That's a bad combo. I seriously thought that was a Pokemon when he first loaded it. Down here. Fuck. We got a Repel. We will use it. Dude, that thing's kind of cool. Torterra, Alakazam together? He kind of fucks. Ariano. I guess Ariados and something ends in Ano. 
Oh. <laughs> it's Dino. <laughs> why Tris Fortress and why not? Oh, it's so fucking happy to be him. He's just happy being himself. And now, he'd be happy being dead. I don't feel like breaking every rock in the game anymore. <laughs> Bro, why his midsection look like the bottom of a leftovers item? Deoxys and Cyndaquil together. Who would have ever imagined that being on your screen today, Chiet? That's why I love randomizers. You never know what you're about to walk into. We got a fork in the road. Oh. Guess it wasn't that big of a fork, but now we do have to backtrack Mihizak because this guy blocking the way. Hiker Pat. He's got a buy fairy. How progressive. Um, let's hit it with a... Flame Burst. Noise. And a Robull. Rotom Granbull, interesting. Uh, Rotom's just the Pokemon of this area, so he's always going to be fused with the other Pokemon in this area. At least that's my understanding of how these work. I guess I can't go that way anymore. Let's do a... I guess we could. Oh. oh, no. Oh, I feel bad for it. It's a shame. So where does that even go to? Oh man, I'm kind of lost. <laughs> oh, this fucking game, bro. Charles Entertainment Cheese. Nobody does it better. Where's... Oh man, I'm so lost. I think that's probably progression. I want to make sure we don't miss anything. Damn it. We need more repels. I'm buying the fuck out of... Dude, that thing's so fucking cool. Dude, that thing's fucking sick, dude. Let me see if I can catch that. Because, I mean, geez, Typhlosion could be used for some good uh, combinations, and, I mean, it never hurts to have a Blastoise. We could probably have some cannons popping out of some motherfuckers. We'll, we'll maybe catch the next one. Oh, okay, that is where we're supposed to go. Actually, I guess there's still that ladder spot. Let me just check that ladder out. Sorry. Wait. Yo, that's massive. That's Metagross. That's Matang. I'm pretty sure it can handle a Dragon Rage from Dragoras, but it's risky at level 14. Six Sunspore, my guy. Nice. We'll whittle it down with this. Perfect. All right. Now that's a long while away. Uh, Metagross has a late evolution, so I'm not sure what to do with it. It'd be nice. But that might be something to grind up later. Maybe we can just catch a Metagross later. And those are two types we don't have any uh, usage of on the team yet. So that's definitely useful in the future. I'm just going to let Butthole Jolteon die there. Low Sweep. Dude, I can't with this thing. That might be one of my favorites we've seen so far. I just fucking can't believe one leg Greg. Really exciting to know we have a Garchomp and we have a Metagross available to us, you know? Joel died. Fuck. Robo <laughs> Oh shit, dude. Probably shouldn't use the fire move. What a fucking bell end I am. We could start we could put the XP share on Joltreon just to level those two up and then rip them apart and they'd still be high level. But I don't know if I'm committing to Jolteon yet. Although we don't have an electric type, so maybe we should. Who knows? A Porion Umbreon would be sick. Yeah, but I already have a water type and a dark type, so. Keck W in the chat. Kling Clang and a Groudon? <laughs> A 
take this thing out of its misery. This never ends. We meet again. Alright, is this thing gonna KYR itself again? You also have no Dragon Rages! Alright, so it did KYR itself there. Probably good here to just fusion ball it. I just want to have more Gengars for it. Uh, also, turning anything into a snake could be fun. Jeez, that's a pretty interesting Pokédex entry. Oh, jeez. Genbok. Love Arbok, love Gengar, perfect Pokemon. I'm gonna rip them apart, though. Cause I need to see what a Gengar plus a Gengar means. What'd you find out, Elena? What'd you find out? Snorlax and Empoleon is literally a Club Penguin sprite. <laughs> Elena, you gotta play this game? You should play this. Max Revive. And we get another Magvi. I'm gonna catch this. I just want to have a ton of BBs. There's no reason not to catch this. Yeah, the fusion ball seemed pretty strong. Please learn flamethrower. Piss. Will this cave ever end? We got a Pichu and a Dodrio together, and it looks like they just want to die. All right, I'm charging my way through the rest of this place. Graveler and a Squirtle. <laughs> Sorry that you exist. Whoa! Giratina Arbok, dude! That thing's sick! I really feel like we're gonna be able to get some really cool Arbok things, because Arbok's just perfect fodder for making a legendary look cooler, in my opinion. Turning any legendary into a snake you probably can't go wrong unless it gets blurry maybe i'm wrong also catch this fuck you god i wish we could have caught that dude that's such a shame we can't catch that Bro, this bitch don't end Yay! all right there was something else up there i cannot be arsed that's how british people talk spell tag all right I don't think we're done yet. It's dangerous to go. We got a hone edge? No. Okay. Free hone edge. It'll eventually turn into Aegislash, which probably could have some good uh, combinations. I'm not sure. So there's a path to the top right and path bottom left. Free poke. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, Vaporeon Nocturne. Oh, no. Oh, it's so bad. Oh, okay, good. It's not no, no, normal type. Hear me out. Uh, Sayak. Sayak. Oh. <laughs> Kill me. And a dugong. No way, is that a dugong with a bronzong? And it made a dugong? Oh. It's just. It's. It's. It's just a dugong. <laughs> it's just a dugong. So. <laughs> That's the first time I've seen a Pokemon by itself in this game. That we didn't rip apart yet, I'm pretty sure. It's just... It's it's just the Dugong. Bro! Why is this cave never ending? Okay, that... Uh, that kind of looks cool. A uh, monkey and a Mimikyu together.
Snubsy. Shut up, Snubsy. <laughs> Spell tag works as a repel. I think you're right. No, that's the cleanse tag? God damn it. Fuck, you lie to me. Shield on and Krogodile? Does spell tag help my Chargar? What did it do? I didn't read it. It increases ghost type damage? Oh, perfect. Okay. Riolar. Graveler and Rioli together do not make a good baby. That's for damn sure. Dude, we're out of moves, bro. Like, this cave's been so long, we have one attack left on our Gengar. That is half Charizard. And we have an A free. Aaron and Butterfree is adorable, and at least it has wings, unlike Lieutenant Surge, who ripped the wings off his fucking Pokemon like a monster. Alright, Chargar's useless. He has no PP on anything besides, um. Confuse Ray. That's insane, bro. Is it. Did I do a loop? I've been here before. Oh, Stardust. Full heal. You need an escape rope? Escape rope's gonna put me where I started. That's a horrible idea. Okay, maybe we have not been here. Never mind. It just looked like that one corner. We made it. It was an insanely long cave. Not battling him. Not battling him. Lavender Town. Alright, so I don't know how to continue in the power plant. Maybe we'll get a key card for that in the future. You're just a trainer? I was afraid to check early because I didn't want to battle, but... Yo, why is it just a regular Porygon 2? What happened? Why are we getting Pokemon that aren't evolved? Heraclos, Raniculus. I will put you out of your misery, my guy. Kofferbach! Coughing. Oh! Dude, that's sick! That's literally Coffer Gigas, but a better, um... Coffin shape. I thought it was gonna be, uh, coughing, but it isn't spelled right, so that makes sense. Um, that's sick. I'm not a big Coffer Gigas guy, but that actually made me like Coffer Gigas for a second. And that's pretty impressive. I think that's what's cool about this game. It makes you, uh, reimagine a few Pokemon that I normally just don't like. Drill Run. No. Fuck you, dude. Ever offer me Drill Run again. Cubones wear skulls, right? People will pay a lot for one. Hey, fuckface, talk to me. I've never seen the clown. Welcome to the nicknaming club. They call me the name raider. I don't name my Pokemon. I'm not a fucking loser. Torment. The only Pokemon I rename are Luxios. I call him Splark. Oh, we're rich people, dude. Holy fuck. We're gonna be able to use reversers and not even do a save state now. Alright, we'll get 10 supper apples.
Maybe I keep the Stardusts. There might be someone at a hotel who wants one later, so let me just keep them until we need money. You never know. What if someone's like, hey, I'll give you something for a Stardust. We get a Moonstone. You leave them in ghosts? Yeah, I do. Really? You're a fucking idiot, she says. Wait, I was told to uh, talk to the clown that hides from awesome people, so let me go see if I can find the clown. Is this the clown? Would you like to hear a joke? What do Scyther swords give it in a competition? The cutting edge. Leave tip. Here's a thousand dollars. You got a full on akakakakaka out of me, guys. He deserves that money. All right, I think we need to do Lavender Town Tower first, so let's go back and do that. We get a Zorbarark and a Hypno together, and it is a goddamn monstrosity. And we get a Rampassus. Rampardos and something asses. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, yeah, I think it's our best interest to just go do the Lavender Tower. I would imagine that's where they want me to go next. Fisher Path is below us, right? I think they just want me to do that. Yeah, this would be the Fisher Path. Old Rod fucking sucks, dude. Where do you get Surf Malibu? That's a Chevy Malibu. Wait, if I was a game dev, I would hide an item back here. Look at this. Lame. Pokemon Tower was erected. Ew! Give me stuff. Did you come to pay respects? Press F to pay respects. I came to pray for my Clefairy. It dead now. Oh, this chode mongler. Does he keep getting worse Pokemon? Muck and Togekiss together. Does that not look like a Muck ate a Togekiss? His Pokemon, like my rival has the worst luck. Yeah, he has a Kyogre, but it's not good. King 2? Uh, Maglery. Maglery? Octillery and Mag Cargo. It's kind of cool looking. I kind of like it. I'm starting to think we should spread our levels out a little bit more. Here comes King 2. And we have a Cyndaquil Flareon. <laughs> Thought there'd be a little bit more red. Honestly, this not having fire for the tail is kind of disappointing. Goodbye. Oh, Cardi on Chargar. Yeah, we need to fucking cool it. Look at his HP stat. Well, I guess that's not a stat. Yeah, it's just a lot. That's just normal HP. Sorry. Um, you stinker. What's that all about? All right, someone's bullying an old man. It looks like. Oh yeah, definitely. All right, so this is where we're supposed to be for sure. Tell us how to make the Master Ball. You were working at Silphco when it was being developed. We know you have the plans. Let's go, we have to make you talk, old man. Oh, jeez. All right, time to save Junkyard. This old man looks like he's in a lot of trouble. If it weren't for all those ghosts, I think they're actually Pokemon, but I don't think I can get past without a Silph Scope. Anyway, I saw a lot of Team Rocket members loitering around Celadon City when I was get, uh, getting my fourth gym badge. I think I'll go back there to investigate. You should come too, Spitty. Smell you later. 
Chad, I have really bad listening and comprehension skills. Should I go get my fourth gym badge, then come back here? Is that what he was saying? Sweet. Okay. I, I do this thing where I read, but I don't listen to myself when I read. I think I'm going to use Dragados again. I'm not really loving Dark Tay until it gets better moves. So let's use Dragados. Chargar's overleveled, and we'll throw some levels on Umbreon and Jolteon. If, and I'll be honest, I don't like these two together. Um, I think this looks horrible. Even its other form, I didn't think was that great. But I still have hope that Jolteon and Umbreon can fuse together with something else to make something really cool. So we'll level them up, we'll rip them apart, we'll give them to someone else. But with that, XP is definitely going to be valuable, so should be fine. Um, I like it, I just think it could be cooler on someone else. This guy's a nerd. Got a little Robo Pikachu. That thing's fucking insane. That's Corsola and a Tentacruel together. That's fucking nuts. Nothing too Dragon Rage just can't fix. Quid Duo, Do Duo, and Quilava? <laughs> Oh, I should have used a water move. Yeah, I guess what we could do is just go check out some Umbreon and... Let's do that. Let's get to Celadon and we'll see what we can make out of a Jolteon and whatever Pokemon we have with Umbreon as well. Uh, Tangela and Kangaskhan together could be interesting. It's not, actually. It's very far from interesting. <laughs> Kangaskhan's also another Pokemon I never felt like. I feel like it's always overlooked. Who wants double kick? Butthole Jolteon? You're a physical attacker. Don't you dare take double kick. There should be new Pokemon to catch here. Mudkip, Remoraid, and boy is that bad. This does give us Octopus opportunities, though, because Remoraid does turn into an Octopus. I don't understand it either, chat, but it does. Let's try it. Let's see. Wow. Uh, this is a game changer. Um, an absolute game changer. We can make whale-sized monstrosities with Garchomps as well. And we are going to be spending a lot of time back in Lavender Town putting things together, Chet. He is him. That's a whole ass submarine, bruh. Also, that just looks awesome. It just by itself it's cool now. I will be ripping them the fuck together. Or apart, but yeah. Um, let's do a... Thunder Wave and we should be able to catch it. Yeah, he's hurting himself too, so we need to be careful. He's KYRing a little bit. Mort Garlord. Okay. <laughs> that is extremely exciting. We got really lucky that Garchomp's just spawning like that. I'm not the biggest Garchomp fan, but I do think he has a few qualities that I think if on the right spot on another Pokemon could make them incredible. So I think he has somewhat of a derpy face, but if we add someone else's face to his, like, scythes or fangs or whatever the hell's coming off of him, we could have something really good. Okay. So we have a Were Lord, and we have a Dragon Ground... Oblivious Whale. I'll have to get the XP share. Well, first off, I don't want you here. Not you, Chad. I'm talking about this uh, this Pokemon. I also... I'm, I'm over it. We're giving Jolteon someone else. So that's two Dragonites together. This is two Miss Magiuses together. Let me just make some space. This is two Eevees together. This is two Darkrai's together. Okay, so now we have... Talon Flame, which has a custom Jolteon design for an electric flying type. It also has an Umbreon dark flying type. That 
thing on the right. I fear that. Okay, so those two are custom. I just want to see the green ones being custom. So there's a custom flying Talonflame Eevee, which is nuts. You always want the green sprites, in case anyone's confused. So let's put him down. Real quick, we just moved a few things. Garchomp, who can you fuse with? Custom Jolteon Garchomp. That'd be a Dragon Electric type. That's a shame. I would love to have Electric Ground. Also, that thing on the right looks horrible. Um, Eevee Garchomp, not custom. Fairy Ground Garchomp Togepi combo. I just need to know. Oh, look at all these Pokemon we have. Oh, we still have this. Hold on. Nothing custom for Arbok Garchomp. What about Gengar Garchomp? Gengar Chomp. Ghost and Ground type. I hate it. <laughs> Engine, K24 block slash K24 head K24A4 block and crank. All refinished. OEM Honda chains and guides more info can't fit it off slash S6500 oboe possible trade call or text. Hidden information. Well said, France. That was one of the most well said things I've ever seen. All right, Arbok with Moltres. Oh, I don't want to reset my save again, but I need to know. I need to know what that looks like. Arbro Arbok Umbreon could fuck. We already tried this, right? Yeah. Arbok Bird. Arbok Mawile. It looks like it's just... Put the Mawai on its tail, maybe. Arbok Eevee, nothing special. Yeah, you can tell it's bad, right? I need to know this. Hold on. Why does that have a custom one? Eevee and Wailord gets smaller? That thing fucks. <laughs> um, Lord. <laughs> um, um, Lord evolved from exposure to the moon's energy pulses. Dude, it's so cool. I don't know if I want this. I miss you. I miss us. Anonymous, thanks for the 10. Okay, this is really sad. We're not saving that. I need to see what the other options are first. I need to see Umbreon with Gengar. No. Oh wait, that sounds like it fucks. I need to see Umbreon with uh, Arbok. And then if we don't like that, we'll go back to Waylord Umbreon. But we also have a water type and a dark type already. It's really kind of redundant to add this to our team. Because this has potential, dude. Wish I could change the face at the top. <laughs> I wish we could change its face. <laughs> oh shit. Chad, I, this reminds me, sorry to go on a tangent. I was watching that, uh, there's a Korean TV show called Physical 100 where all these jacked people from Korea, um, they, they compete in these competitions, right? 
And at the beginning, they all walk, there's a hundred of them. They all walk into the room and they talk to each other, right? And this one guy walks in. It's a, I was watching the dubbed version of it because I wasn't paying too much attention. But this guy walks in and he goes, I have the best body here from the waist down. And I looked over at the screen. He was kind of a butterface. And I thought it was really funny because the camera showed his body from the waist up, then showed his face. And he like was saying that he had a butterface. And that's what reminded me of this one, dude. He said it, not me, by the way, chat. But it was... It's pretty that, that just reminded me of this. Um, guy had a great physique though, but yeah. Um, I don't think we can use this, but goddamn, do I love it. Umbach. So that'd be a dark poison type. Yeah, I really like it, but I think we can do better, right? Oh, I really. I'm just gonna unfuse them. I don't feel like resetting right now. Sorry. Minus three hundred dollars. It's fine. <laughs> oh, fuck, I am. Okay, I'm gonna go pass out now. Later, brother. <laughs> this thing needs to pass out, bro. This would be a fire dark type. We don't need another one of those. I'm gonna combine a bunch of stuff together. We'll just cancel the save. Wait, I still have one of these. I forgot. Hold on. Use with. Please let it work. Oh, we already did this. I forgot how bad that was. Oh, fuck me, dude. This looks like it has potential. I love Talonflame. I love Jolteon. I don't love that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it's not awful. Look at his little beak. <laughs> I like it, I just think we could do better. Speedy, please take a look at Garchomp Tentacruel Smile. Yeah, we could do that. You're saying Tentacruel and... First off, do you have one? That's a penis. There's a Darth Vader tip on the end of that cock, bro. Look at that thing. Holy shit. What does this make? <laughs> Water ground type. What, what would that be? Like Swampert? Ew. You fuck with it? Well, let's give yourself some more options. We're resetting all this. and None of this matters right now. I just want to give myself some options. We have Dark Cries and Dragonites still. And like, why do we need to be fully in love with Entei with Dark Cry? Like, yeah, we love it. But has it run its course? You know, that's possible. That one on the right looks horrible. That'd be a Dragonite Garchomp. There's a Darkrai Garchomp. That doesn't look that great. That would be Dragonite and... Whoa. Does that not look like Charizard? That's like a shiny Charizard. Oh, it's so cool. Dark dragon type. And then it's, it's like hair goes all the way down through its body to its tail. It has like shiny Charizard qualities to it as well. Will friendship bread plushies be on sale anytime soon? Uh, they might be, Bullet. You said you were going to bed! Okay, let's make sure we never see that again. A 
fuck are you guys telling me to reverse it, but I'm clearly reversing it right now. Uh, Dirty Grenade, thanks for the 12 months. <laughs> Bro, I love him. <laughs> I fucking love him. <laughs> oh, shit. He's so cool. I don't know what we learned from all this. I don't know what I like from all of this. I don't want every Pokemon on my team to be half Darkrai. Like, what the fuck do we do? I, we learned we learned too much that it's overwhelming. All right. Poster child. Let's find out then. Poster child of Pokemon, what do you turn into? Not horrible. Doesn't really make me too excited though. There's like some primal Groudon going on with the lines. I don't love the fire being so bland in the back. I think we can do better. Don't get me wrong, it fucks. But how hard does it fuck? And can it maintain a boner? I don't think so. So let's do this. Jolteon Charizard. I love it. Will we be using it? Absolutely not. <laughs> Dude, it's sick. Why is it so cool? I actually love it. A Charlord flies in search of strong opponents. This could be massive. This could be one we choose forever. No. It's great, don't get me wrong. But we can do better. Well, that's miserably bad. Why is that default? That's not horrible. Could be a dragon fire type. I wish it had the ground typing though. I'm not gonna use that, don't don't get too worried. Oh my fucking god. Wow. I think I speak for all of us when I say I thought that'd be just a little bit cooler. It's still great, don't get me wrong. I just feel like the snake part in the middle, like where he puffs himself out, I feel like that could be more detailed and more cool. But it's still pretty cool. I think we have a lot of chances with Arbok in, in terms of being like pretty neat. Fuck, we're poor people on splicers. Dude, I hate having all these options, chat. Kind of like sister, you know what I mean? Yeah, this is why there's 175,000 possibilities. This is why people told me, hey man, eventually, you're never going to get anything done. Like, we hardly have any Pokemon. We have one box of Pokemon right now, guys, and we're freaking out. I may be wrong. I, did we do Dragonite yet? The two orange Barneys? Speedy. Dude, that's sick. That's so Pokedex? fucking sick. No, there's no way we 100% the Pokédex. Dude, that's sick. That's like a, you know I had to do it to him, Zard. Like, he's literally doing the you know I had to do it to him stance. Like that, uh, that fuck boy in the boat shoes. That's incredible. <laughs> At 
this point, oh. you could just use that calc. It does use the custom sprites. Oh, I like going it this way, guy. You might as well just see what Entei could, could bring us. Ooh, this is a problem. Because we did fall in love with uh, Entei. Oh, Jesus Christ. We fell in love with Entei Darkrai way too soon, maybe. What's up, Psych Attack? Yeah, we did double Dragonite. I hate that. Just absolutely hate it. The face. Yeah, I think I would like it if the eyes were a little more intimidating and the white of the Entei thing was black or something. Or darker purple. Like that white uh, mustache makes him look just old or something. It doesn't look intimidating. I think we did this already, right? Modern Frosty, thanks for five months. Yeah, we already did that before, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> no snake options. Oh. Not horrible. What do you make? I feel like that's honestly lazy. <laughs> oh god. Garchomp Darkrai, did we not do that? Why? <laughs> Why don't you even have any red on you? <laughs> So that'd be a dark ground type at that point. Oh no, I hate that Darkrai is so good because it gives us too many options. Like it's it's frustratingly good. This could change everything. Bro. <laughs> Why is it so awesome, dude? <laughs> Darkrai is a serious problem. But legit, we have enough Darkrais that we could do like a six-person team with a different type on top of Dark. And that's so annoying because there's so many chances for greatness. Did we do Umbreon and Darkrai together? That looks horrible. No way this is good. <laughs> Would give us our electric type we need. This could be insane. It could get a little McDonald's-y with the red and yellow, though. I really... One of my biggest pet peeves color scheme-wise is red and yellow together. I can't not think of fast food. So it's going to be a no for me. We got one of our biggest monstrosities yet. And that was from Tentacruel. Let's see what tentacles possible. Oh, I want to know, but I don't want to undo it. Oh, this was the penis. I wanted to see what this looked like. A little locker room envy here. Let's see. Okay, right, that's incredible. I'm not going to use it, but that's fucking great. It's not too much. It's just perfect. It's just perfect. That'd be a water poison type if I wanted it. I think tentacle has some options to get some, like, just complete abomination. Oh, it's in, it's just incredible. It's it's just incredible. It's so good. It's so goddamn good. That'd be a dark poison type then. We already saw the Garchomp. Oh, I hate having all these options. A water ghost type. I 
It's out there, but it works. Fucking hate Ambipon. Let's see what he can turn into. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot we still had this thing. Bark! I'm not surprised it makes that noise. Do we do this yet? Bro, you, you know I had to do it to him, bro. God damn. Alright, let's see what we can do with this sword. This sword's fucking sweet. Oh, it's incredible. Okay, so, what did we learn from all this? I legit have no clue what to do whenever we reset. We learned Darkrai makes every Pokemon better? Yeah. I think I know what I'm gonna do. It might take a few seconds. Hold my beer. So, let me look at our current team. We have Dragados. Oh, fuck me, dude. We neglected the Gyarados balls the entire time. Hold on. We're going to do one more reset after this. I need to see who Gyarados fuses with. That's the last thing we need to figure out for this puzzle piece. It's kind of like your sister, Chet. It fucks. It fucks so hard. <laughs> so here's the problem. I think I'm removing Entei from Darkrai as much as I love it. Oh, I'll explain that later. Hold on. Let me just figure out. Because I want to get Dragonite off of... Gyarados. I really like it, but I think we're going to be putting uh, Dragonite with someone else. Right, that's going to suck. That will not suck. Holy fuck, this could be insane. Squavit and Gyarados, it might fuck love you, streamer man. Squavit's Gen 8, you goober, and there's no Gen 8s in this game. Dog water. Oh, this is nuts. That's so fucking good. Except for the fact that he has, you know, British people teeth. Um, fuck, I don't have to do. Bro, I can already tell his mouth is gaping. Never mind. Wow. Wow, that's that's something. <laughs> it's everything that's wrong with Mega Gyarados. Mega Gyarados could be one of the best Pokemon in the entire history of design if they just made it longer. The problem with Mega Gyarados is it's a short little prawn, and it just needs a longer uh, body, and it could be amazing, and this reminds me of that. All right, we are getting smarter with the tech. You just spam space here, and you get out of here sooner. Um, look at its sprite. Holy fuck. Yo, my man straight grinning, my dude. Alright, we need to think. There's Garchomp Gyarados, there's Umbreon Gyarados, and Gang Gendos. Gangarados. I would probably change his name to Gangarados. Some of the names are a little lazy. I feel like we could make a better name combining them sometimes. Uh, this is amazing. And I think we are going to be removing Gengar from Charizard, even though it's so fucking funny. Did we do this yet? No, we didn't. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Why does his face look like that? No. Dude, he's so cool. Just give him a better face. No. That smile. That damned smile. Damned smile. Alright, that's honestly amazing, but... um, Is not good enough for this game, considering some of the other options we have. Oh, Alright. Well, we already have that, obviously. That's the one we were rocking. So this is what we already had. I think that's incredible. But... I think we're going to take Dragonite and put it together with Darkrai. Entei's going to get benched, and then I think we do a Garchomp Gyarados for now. Oh, but it's Dragon Water, not Dragon Ground, though. That's so fucking stupid. Why, why don't we have a uh, agency over that? Like, I feel like we should be allowed to do a Water Ground type. <laughs> oh, I really need to get an. I need to get a uh, Arcanine really bad. Hold on. Let's do some spitting. We're never gonna play the game at this point. Let's make some decisions. We can always rip them apart in the future. It's fine. But we're about to do a serious team alignment change here, though. We have Dragados, which is Dragonite Gyarados. We have <laughs> Chargar, <laughs> and we have Dark Tay. I think I think Darkrai and Entei look incredible together. I just don't know if we're gonna keep them together. We can always put them back together in the future. Here's what this could be. We jokingly kept it as the ugly one. I don't think that's amazing. I think we're I think we're removing these two from each other. Charger is that dude. Do we try Gyarados and Charizard together? Oh fuck me! Are we gonna do more fusing? Damn it! Oh my god. In the last hour, we have done nothing but make monstrosities. But this might be our final reset. Little mad at Dragon Water, but that's okay. I like that. I think Gyarados is always going to have some cool combos, so we can maybe do something else with him in the future. But we do need to level up a this dude. Alright, let's move you, because I think we're using you. Place. You're staying for your abilities. You are getting unfused. This Gengar, I don't know who to put him with yet. It's a sad day. I think we're gonna bench Entei. Level 34 Dragonite with Darkrai. This will be our Dark Dragon. So we'll have two Dragon types on the team, but I mean, that's always gonna be a thing because dragons are just sick. I fucking love this dude. I think he's staying with us for the bit, for a while. I mean, that's fucking dope as shit. Yeah, welcome to the fucking team, buddy. Was Charizard and him cool? Well, he was kind of derpy, wasn't he? Did we ever do this one on the far right? Charizard and Lapras, I promise. Lapras is one of the best designs in the game, and we honestly should give it some love. Let's give it a shot. Oh my god, this is the one. I completely forgot we had Lapras. That's it. That's the look. That's our fucking Pokemon right there.
we try these? We probably did, right? <laughs> That's it. That's the one. <laughs> All right. I I don't think we. At this point, we have to keep that. That's so fucking good. So we have, and the best part is it loses its water type and gains ice. So now we have a ghost ice, we have a dragon water, and this way we can still use Lapras without having redundant water typing. Then we have dark dragon. So two dragons, but that's fine, because this guy's dope as shit. So now Charizard needs a boyfriend. Fuck, I don't know what to do. That Charizard's gotta go with something before we continue. Oh, fuck me, I'm gonna do it, aren't I? Oh, I'm gonna do it. Oh, I'm gonna fucking do it, chat. God damn it. I knew I was gonna do it, that's so sad. If a hemorrhoid had wings, claws, and legs. Oh, is that so bad? I'm not a big Mawile fan. This really makes me hate Mawile. Alright, I think we can finally play the video game, chat. So much combining. This, game, this is gonna be so fucking awesome. Alright, let's save all that. I'm happy with everything we've done. Once again, nothing really matters because we can always just rip the Pokemon apart. But we have these guys now. We have Chenros, we have Gardos, <laughs> Charlord I'm not in love with, but it's whatever. And Dark Knight. But it's good to have a Charizard. We can do anything with him in the future. It was all worth it. Okay. Um, and you guys were saying something about Wonder Trade. Where do I do that at? Wonder Trade allows you to trade a Pokemon with a random trainer around the world. With premium tickets, the Pokemon you get are more rare and guaranteed to have a custom sprite. You can get more premium tickets by defeating gym leaders. You can also purchase standard tickets from my colleague, of course. Would you like to make a Wonder Trade? This will automatically save the game. Alright, so I grabbed Talonflame as trade fodder. <laughs> oh, I fucking love T-Tar. T-Tar's one of my favorite Pokemons ever. <laughs> Thanks, Emily, for Corona. <laughs> that was really kind of you to give that to me. Okay, um, let me go get some more trade fodder. Uh, T-Tar's one of my favorite Pokemons of all time. I, I think Tyranitar is just incredible with his derpiness, so I'm excited to see what dumb shit he can turn into once we get one. Slow King to Charizard. Uh, are we... Uh, honestly, I hope we don't get anything too cool from Wonder Trade. Because that means we're going to spend the next 30 minutes wonder, uh, combining shit again. Is it foul play to send a Meryl out into the wild? Like, it's kind of being a dick, right? Mr. Rossetti from Animal Crossing? You can't unfuse a Wonder Trade? So this thing's stuck like this forever? Thanks, Anne. I love it. Lady Bus Centret. Thanks, Anne. Russell sends Rascal. I'm gonna guess, chat. Rascal's gonna be Octillery, Lapras. Nope. Neither. Pincer Tauros? Is that what I'm looking at? Is that a Pincer Tauros? Alright, so if I can't do anything with these, let me just make sure I know where they are so I don't get tempted in the future and confused. I think I'm out of Wonder Trade tickets, right? Oh, I have still one more, okay. Here's a Mawile, you can't unfuse it. <laughs> and France sends Twitter. If I had to guess, it's probably gonna be someone really angry at life, and instead of living out in the real world, they take to Twitter to constantly bitch about every inconvenience they have with their life, is what this Pokemon's gonna look like. Yep, that looks like a Twitter user. Also, I kinda wanna put Entei and Darkrai back together. 
Ooh, should I do that real quick? I just really like those two together. And this was a combo that I think is incredible. You can mix it. There's 175,000 possibilities, chilled. 175,000 possibilities. Uh, let's do... I guess the sleeping one. <laughs> and we will do modest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, the, I'm... Uh, the problem is, and I was saying this earlier, we haven't played the game in two hours because I've just been fusing Pokemon together, and we only have one box full of Pokemon opportunities. And, like, we're just not playing the game because we can't get to the game. And I'm not mad about it. I'm just overwhelmed. Quick attack. I'm not going to use Roar, so might as well. Yeah, let's just put him back on the team just so we have him. Obviously, we already have a Darkrai with a Dragonite, but this would at least give us some option if something faints or something. So let's do that, because I love that. That Dark Tay is so good. Maybe we can always have space for two Darkrais on the team at once, you know? And the best part is, every single trainer has a monstrosity of a Pokemon. Chilled Wylan, what do you say? But she, oh, you can. I mean, you can't do Dark Magician Girl with Lola Bunny, Low Punny, but you can do Vaporeon and Low Punny. And once we get those, we're going to. Now, here's a big issue. I actually have the ability to make a, a Vaporeon right now, but I'm not letting the viewers know that. Oh, dude, Dark Knight's so sick. Is this a double battle? I don't think our second Pokemon's set up for this. Oh, oh, oh. Bro, that's a Typhlosion and a Sea King together? Oh, that thing's disgusting. <laughs> Also, my Gardos takes up the whole screen. Oh, jeez. Does Ominous Wind hit both? No. Let's do Dragon Rage on this guy. And Ice Fang on him since he's Grass-type and just get rid of him. And then we'll leave that monstrosity on the screen no longer. He actually hung in there on that, damn it. These guys both have Dragon Rage. I love Dragon Rage. <laughs> Scotch says me and Seal Lotion have the same posture. <laughs> Dude, I got that nerd neck too, don't feel bad. Straight nerd neck. Wait, Twister hits both, that's the one. I should have been using that the whole time. There we go. <laughs> Alright, that's honestly disheartening to know that those two little girls own that stupid Seeking to type Lotion combo. All right, let's see what these people have. Dude, that's so sick. Parasect with Umbreon in it? Bro, I love it. It's very McDonald's-y, don't get me wrong, but I love it. <laughs> this is level 27, we're getting some higher level Pokemon now. We can't just Dragon Rage twice anymore, so now I think we have to actually use our brain when we play the game. That was not a good use of our brain there. Then in Mort Charlord. <laughs> okay, <laughs> he looks so bad. Uh, maybe we stop using him. I don't know if I like Wailord Charizard very much, but it's fine. Until we find Charizard a more compatible buddy, we'll do this for now. Hold on, I want to battle everyone. Sorry, I'm a little bit of a nerd. I need that sweet Nectary experience, you know? <laughs> Does he look like that? It's, it looks like a water balloon, dude. It's a cums. It's just incredible because Dark Knight looks so fucking cool, right? And then there was the thing. Ray? Yume? Bro, this could be Rayquaza. This could be our first look at Rayquaza. <laughs> what did they do to Rayquaza? <laughs> Why did Gloom take over? No! Oh no! The poor guy. Dude, once we get Rayquaza, if we get Rayquaza, everything's gonna change. We are gonna combine him with that. Like, imagine an Umbreon Rayquaza. No, no Snorlax yet, chill, but once... Once... 
Nacho! <laughs> uh, once we, uh, once we get Snorlax, we're gonna have so much fun just making all the Snorlaxes. Uh, let's just keep the Dragon Rage theme going. It's still working on a two-shot. And we're out of PP, that's wonderful. Um, let's just twist with it. Trip. Victrical? Alright, we got a Victory Bell coming out. Let's bring in Chargar. Yeah, we're out of PP. <laughs> Dude. Oh no, it's Shuckle and Victory Bell. <laughs> um, Flame Burst. No PP, what's the point? Uh, Shillet. I took a Shillet in my toilet today. Um... <laughs> That's Shinx and Golit. Let's see what Gengar looks in battle now. I love this Lapras Gengar. And we got Fortress with Alakazam, and I fucking love it. <laughs> and we get a Turn Pip. This could be Turchwip. All right, <laughs> Turchwig and Piplup, right? No, that would be Lup. What would it be Popip and Turchwig? Yep. <laughs> yep, indeed. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Oh shit, that was not a good showing for Turtwig. Not a good showing. And we'll do a little scare you from the back surprise here. We get a horsey with an Ivysaur. I like it. I really like that, actually. It's not the best, but I like it. Gardas levels up, and she's gonna send out a Probo Bell. <laughs> <laughs> Weeping Bell and Probo Pass, dude. That's insane. Insanely bad. Twister's really weak. Jarlord. Oh, that's a bad idea. We got Splarked. That's fine, though. I might start leading with Genros, because Genros has better moves, I think. Um, Halchura. Honchkrow and Zorua. <laughs> Looks like an enemy from Super Mario Galaxy. Or Odyssey. Dude, Odyssey is one of the best dick jokes. I can never get anyone with it, though. I'm always like, hey, what was that Mario game where you can, like, throw his hat? And they, they always, like, know it's a dick joke. I don't know. <laughs> it's our first look at Mr. Mime, I think. This might be actually be an upgrade. Might actually be one. Yeah, I think uh, Mario Odyssey and Sea Urchin are the two best dick jokes. Um, I think those are going to stand the test of time. I really do think so. I've been studying the market. Odyssey, this dick in your mouth. Like, ought to see instead of Odyssey. And we got a Pharaoh Sire. So, Ferrothorn and Quagsire. You son of a bitch. I'm in. Oh my god, that thing looks miserable. There you go. You're not in pain anymore. Wow. Whoa! <laughs> it's a parachuting deli bird d drift limb. That's insane. Catch this. Wow, that's so cool. And a Comfion. That's going to be a Comfy with a Leafy on or some type of Eon. <laughs> Wait, is that a. No, oh, that's a Combuskin. That's not. A... Yeah, that's a Combuskin, not a Comfy. There's so many prefixes and suffixes in the Pokemon world. Anoma. <laughs> Look at his eyes. <laughs> Look at his eyes. Oh, I didn't mean to use Sucker Punch, but it wasn't horrible. What kind of pose is that? That guy was half motorcycle, half person. That was a pretty cool combo. Um, we have a Gliscor with a Nidorina, or Nidoran. Nice one, Johnny. Are you a trainer? Yes, you are. Gambler Stan. We got a Growlithe and a Miss Magius. <laughs> and a Gromander. This could be a Turtle Chilled. This could be Grottle. This could be a Fiery Turtle. It's possible. It was, um... Groful... It was, a. Uh, What's his name? Gro Grovel? The middle form of fuckface? Grovile? I never knew how to pronounce that. Grovel? 
And I'm sorry it's not a turtle. <laughs> What has science done? Nidoran? Aerodactyl could be nuts. It was not nuts. I think that's Nido Queen, actually. The Queen herself. What do you got, my guy? Give me experience. Mimikyu and Crocodile together are, are yikes. Shadow Ball should hurt you pretty. M Was that a disguise? God damn it. I was so excited for my Shadow Ball. I was like, wow, Shadow Ball's gonna hurt you so much until it didn't. Back to Dragon Rage Strats. I'm the best trainer ever. And he's gonna bring out a Dwellius. Is this a Zwell? Wait, time out. This could be insane. This is a Zwellius and a Dino, I believe. And Zwellius evolves from Dino. So this could be the one headed fuck with the two headed fuck. Nothing changes. Wait, I think they put Dino's head on top of Zwellius. Okay, that's really disappointing, but... This is gonna hurt a lot. <laughs> it just moved a little closer. Because we early... Uh, when we first uh, started this game the other day, we got a cloister that actually moved back inside of a shelter, which it evolved from. Because it was a cloister shelter mixed, and it was insane. Now we got a Quill Rogue. Quill and Tyrogue. No, Quillfish and Tyrogue. Even worse. <laughs> uh, KYR cargo shorts. Dude, cargo shorts are the uh, future, guys. I know. We were told not to wear those in the 10 years. Like, you know what I mean? How do you say How do you say 2010 through 2020? Do you say the 10s? What the fuck am I supposed to say for that? Is, is that is, do I just say the 10s? We weren't allowed to wear cargo shorts in the 10s. Because women told us they were ugly. But we're bringing them back because we need to put stuff in our pockets. The 2010s? I guess that's right. Alright, looks like we uh, cleared this route. Something mighty, too. I mean, we were so large back there. What's up, pussy? Hey, it's $10,000 if you want to go through here. Okay. Oh, fuck me. The 2010s. I can't say the word 20 correctly, so I'll just say 10s. Always check the trash can, guys. You'll never, never, never guess what someone might put in there. Where the fuck I am right now, dude? Celadon City. That's where the fuck... This is a new route, though. We could get some uh, good Pokemon here. <laughs> okay, um, this does give us options. This will allow us to see what a Garchomp and a Garchomp together looks like. This will also allow us to see what a Whale Lord and a Whale Lord together looks like. And I, for one, personally find that to be pretty cool. Gotcha, bitch. Let me see if we can catch one more. That would be easier than unfusing mine. Polymander. That's so sick, dude. Catch this. Kinda nice to know there's just Garchomps on standby, though. Oh, no. Oh, we're about to spend so much time with the PC chat. Mewtwo and Kling Clang. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, we're about to spend another hour at the PC combining up Mewtwo with every goddamn thing we have. I mean, Jesus Christ. I wonder what your catch rate is. Sometimes it's just too easy. The genetic gear Pokemon. And it's not my fault we ran into a Mewtwo. Let's see if we can catch another uh, Garchomp with... Oh, Poly... Oh, that's so cute, guys. Look how cute it is. And it's gone. Another Eevee if we want it. I don't think we're short on Eevees, so let's just kill it. We still have two Eevees that are, like, butt-fucking each other in the PC, so we should be good for a bit. Double Mewtwo? Whoa! 
Venonat. No, this is a Butterfree, actually, with a Bulbasaur. That's adorable. I actually am going to catch this. I love Butterfree, and I feel like we could... Even if we don't use them, we could see what some Butterfree Pokemon look like. And we could get some Venusaur Possibilitas in the future. I love this game. I wish I had other responsibilities. I think we're going to play this tomorrow, too, Chad. I don't think we have anything tomorrow. I don't think I'm in any sessions tomorrow. We might just play this for like eight hours tomorrow. Soft, of course. I'm not going to be hard for it, but it should be fun. Um, let's put that away. What if we found out what a Mewtwo with a Mewtwo looked like? Sometimes it's just too easy. Gardos, level 30, learn something, you schmuck. We also have to unfuse two Pokemon to get our Wailord and our Garchomp. What the fuck? Goldeen and Hoppip. That should kill. Oh my god! Alright, this we need to catch. This is Kingler, which has some good options, but also Infernape. And we do have an Amonferno, but this would be easier. Um, Infurler. What's up, guys? My name's Infurler. It's such a good one. Dude, this is like a great spot to catch Pokemon. We about to spend a lot of time at the PC. Okay. Um That's okay. We'll do it the long We'll do it the long way. Uh we'll just remove the Garchomp and the Whale Lord from this. It's fine. I'm just gonna save beforehand. Nobody does music better than Pokemon and Donkey Kong, bro. Donkey Kong Country soundtrack, it fucks, guys. I love Donkey Kong Country. Fuck it, I'll even play Tropical Freeze and Returns, bro. They're all so good. Okay, let's do a save job. Alright. Now we play the game. The real game. The sit in your PC all day long game. Wait, hold on. Go this, though. All right, let's get some Celadon spoilers. Is this the place with the big, tall-ass motherfucker uh, store? 30 splicers. Five more reversers. And give a motherfucking some Pokeballs. You keep spending like that, you're gonna be poor. So we're gonna do the same thing we did last time, guys, where we just combine everything together and then reset the save. Remember what we like the most, then add them to the team. All right, so now we have an Infernape and a Curb. Infernape's going to be a lot of options. I think at some point we need to get more organized here and move, like, good things to good boxes. But why do today what we can do tomorrow? All right, so there's a Whale and there's a Garchomp. Not to be confused with my wife. The Garchomp, I mean. Oh, jeez, I almost got in trouble there. What does a Whale look like if you combine it? with another whale. Now, I will give you guys a little bit of, I will give you a little warning here. If it's green, that means it's gonna have a custom sprite. You always want green. <laughs> Dude, it reminds me of that one fish from Animal Crossing that was like just torso fish. I forget, it's a real fish, I can't think of its name, but you guys know which one I mean from Animal Crossing. <laughs> Bro, get my selfie off your screen. Oh my God. <laughs> 47 feet tall. Oh, the Tinder matches. What a stud. Okay, so we will just keep him like that for now. Actually, you know what? We already saw it. Let's unfuse it. I want to see what Mewtwo in a whale looks like. We all do. Let's be honest. We're all thinking it. Garchomp, a perennial fan favorite. Fusing with a Garchomp makes a g -g 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 Garchomp. This is like when they put Dunsparce together and called it d d d duns Why are his hands like that, bro? Dude, Garchomp has a big fan base, and I would be pissed if I was a Garchomp fan. Luckily, I'm not, so I think it's funny that this thing sucks. <laughs> Yo, why he look like that? Garchomp and Mewtwo are gonna fuck, so we might as well. Figure this out. Butterfree with Butterfree, I need to know, because I love Butterfree. I will not be using it, though, because it's a Butterfree. 
Oh, maybe I use it. This looks awesome. Oh, which set was Blowjob Gengar from? Uh, chat, correct me if I'm wrong. Blowjob Gengar is Lost Origin, right? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love this Butterfree. There you go. You can stay right there. Kling Clang with Kling Clang. Do you two fuse? Let's find out. They made Kling Clang Clang Clang, bro. Wow. Okay, that's good for that screen right now. Mewtwo and Mewtwo need to fuse into Mew4? Am I doing my math right? That just looks like Mega Mewtwo. Isn't that just Mega Mewtwo? It's just Mewtwo Y, right? I mean, don't get me wrong, it's sick, and it's nice to have just as a regular Pokemon. It's great, but... A little bit on the lame side. Mewtwo with Charizard. <laughs> I'm gonna be asked. Not my favorite thing in the world, but dude, it's good. It's pretty goddamn good. Let's try it the other way around. Oh, I like that one more. Can't unsee its diaper. Yeah, yeah, it's wearing a diaper. I can't use it. That's a good point. I didn't notice that. I'm going to start at the top row. That way we don't get lost. Dragonite Mewtwo. They look horrible. I don't even want to see them. Um, <laughs> no EV opportunities. Infernape Mewtwo. What the fuck? That sprite looked insane. I hate it. I hate it. There's like eight, it looks like a Jackson Pollock painting, bro. It's like there's just colors that don't need to be there. <laughs> and why does he have a mullet? That's such a shit hairstyle. Oh. Mewtwo Togepi. Oh, I bet that's so fucking cute. Um, nothing special with Jolteon. Umbreon Mewtwo. People's Warrior, thanks for the Prime sub. Wake Man and Bing Chillin', thanks for... Oh my god. Thoughts, chat? Thoughts? Can we see Wailord Bulbasaur? And then I'll disappear into the night? I got you. It has like that Judgment of Anubis to it, you know? I will right, we'll come back to that. Uh, Chilled would like to see a Bulbasaur Wailord combo. Chilled, I'll even ask you, left or right, Chilled? We'll do both, but which one would you like to see first? The left one, he the says. Oh, God. Over 11 pounds. That's a lot of that is a lot. I had to hear it again. Who wouldn't? Thanks for performing. 6x Purge Champ, by the way. 6 time Purge it's Champion. It's a pleasure coming. To watch you always, King. Oh my god, it is. Thank you, Caitlin. And thanks for being top D today. Mewtwo Dark Rye. We getting there, brother. Yes, it <laughs> It's so derpy. It has like that ditto face. Bro, that thing's amazing. Bro, it's so good. I'm interested to see what it turns into when it's a Venusaur. That squirt is so amazing. That's a sentence I never thought I'd say. Water grass type. Is that John Sand person? Holy fuck. What's up, John? Will I catch a Pokemon for you? Absolutely. Can't believe that dude bald Rizzo, bro. Please do Mewtwo Waylord. It's totally worth smiley face. Smiley Mewtwo Waylord will do it. We gotta reverse this for Chilled first. Before he disappears into... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. Oh god, that's bad. Just horrible. I'm gonna, it's so bad I'm going to keep it together for now. Okay, so you want Mewtwo and who? Mewtwo Wailord. I think we have a Wailord in page two, right? Let's see, Bobby.
Is he so fucking jacked? He's got like such chest muscles. I mean, Mewtwo normally does, so I guess it makes sense, but he looks more jacked. Like he's full on Giga Chad mode, bro. And look at that bulge. It's so impressive. He's a fucking Chad. I'm sending this to side. <laughs> oh no, he's grabbing the strap. Holy fuck. The genetic whale Pokemon. That is incredible. Okay, um, did we do Mewtwo and Garchomp yet? Let's find out. Psychic Ground. It's pretty cool. Let's reverse it. <laughs> oh god. We need to know Mewtwo and Gengar together. Wait, I didn't see which one. Fuck, we'll just reverse it. <laughs> I love the ones where Gengar just gets a new face. It's like our Chargar, bro. <laughs> oh no. Okay, let's give him the reverse job. This one might just have a stupid... Okay. <laughs> Oh, no, it's just a purple Mewtwo with red eyes. Dark Cry with everything is amazing. This could be the best one. It's possible. That's definitely not the best one. That's fucking horrible. Let's see the reverses, too. <laughs> um, you want the Dark Cry color scheme. The Dark Cry color scheme is where Dark Cry excels, because black and red together are always gonna slap. Always slap together. This one's gonna be black and red. It's black and white. That's incredible, though. Where's the red, though? Why can't we have a poot of red on that? Please reverse the Mewtwo Whale Lord. It's straight come Lamau. Mewtwo Whale Lord reversed is come. Okay, wow, that's great feedback. Yeah, it looks like Zekrom, right? So you're saying use this? <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> oh, that's so fucking bad. Give me one second. I need to pee, chat. God damn. I would be remiss if I didn't try Moltres Mewtwo. That looks like it's going to suck, right? We'll try. It looks like it's gonna suck. It sucks. He's like dabbing. Pussy says what? Uh, what? Fuck. I would love to get Tentacruel involved if possible, but we have to unfuse him first. That sucks. <laughs> Why does he have a happy dick? <laughs> What a moment. Why does he have such a happy dick? What the fuck did they do? Can you... Do you think those are holes? And, like, you have to, like, just finger him with, like, two... F <laughs> Why does he look like that? Do you just finger him like a bowling ball? I don't know what the fuck's going on here, bro. <laughs> Oh my fucking god, that's so funny. It's so fucking... I think we should do a playthrough of this game where... Like, because right now we're trying to, like, do this game with cool Pokemon. But we should do one in the future where we just, like, find the funniest shit possible. Um, I think that would honestly be really fun. Do, like, a... Oh god, that's so bad. It won't be a sexy typing, but... It might be cool. Big. It's so large. Oh, Tentacruel me <laughs> It's so fucking cute, bro. It means well. You can tell it has a good demeanor to it. Yeah, I know. Once we get a Tyranitar, everything's gonna change. Alright, let's bring our Tentacruel. If you guys didn't see our Tentacruel Garchomp earlier, it might be the most cursed thing we've seen in this Let's Play yet. It was insane. It's actually usably insane. Like, it's, it's possible to be used, I think. 
to explain what usably means. And then what did I want to do? Mewtwo with Pentacruel? Was not what I was expecting. Why does that look like it's from Rick and Morty? I think it's those things they wore on their face that one time where they assimilated with that one tribe. It had potential from the sprite. It's sick as fuck, don't get me wrong. This thing's amazing, but I think we can do better. The amount of custom sprites in this game is incredible. Like, absolutely just mind-numbingly incredible. Did not expect these guys to have a green one. <laughs> Bubba! <laughs> Uh, the fact that that thing has a serious nature is so insane. This thing does not look very serious. Baba. Thank you for the two fusions, Speedy. You're such a chad. Yeah, of course, ass mechanic. Some of these are just cursed. Where's his eyes? <laughs> Why did they just get rid of his eyes? <laughs> Bro, it's actually really sick. Give it some googly eyes, if, if anything. So that's Charizard, and I want this, though. I think the right one could be good. Look at his tail. We need Blastoise, and we need Venusaur as well. Because I'm trying to think of, like, what Pokemon would get custom stuff. It's going to be the normie Pokemon. Like, the Pokemon that get the most love are going to have the the most insane opportunities. <laughs> oh my fucking god, he's precious. Jinx when? We actually saw some Jinxes before, um, and they're pretty cool. We also saw a Giratina... Was it a Giratina Arbok we ran into earlier? That thing was incredible. Uh, but a trainer had it, so we couldn't catch it. Okay, at some point we need to just, like, ask the question. What did... Was there anything that we loved with Mewtwo? Would it just be Umbreon Mewtwo for the judgment of Anubis, and then we get, like, our, our psychic type on our team? Why do you guys love Hone Edge so much? Every time I look at chat, Hone Edge, Speedy! Hone Edge and Mewtwo! What the fuck? This could be sick. Be a great idea. I see why you guys like Hone Edge. Uh, holy fuck. That's awesome, dude. I'm still gonna bitch every time you think Hone Edge is cool, chat, but this is sick. <laughs> So that's a Steel Psychic? Bro, that's so fucking badass. So what does Aegis slash Mewtwo look like? Should we should we just roll with this? Because we don't have a Steel or a Psychic type and just level this thing up so we can see what Aegis slash's possibilities are? Here's my problem though. Like I like personality with my Pokemon and if I can't see your eyes, that's a problem. Although I guess technically he's holding one of Hone Edge's eyes down there. So I guess it does have personality. Hold on. Let's not get married yet, though. Hold on. I Hone Edge Mewtwo, pretty good possibility, huh? I really think Aegis Slash is going to have some good options in the future, too, though. So thing on the right looks fucking awesome. What, dude, Metagross, we need to level up our Herbatang. I don't even want to see the monstrosity that would create. Wait. Angler options, dude. Crab snake. Half crab, half snake. Dylan, thanks to the 11. Oh my god. That's... That's something. We already... Wait, no we don't. Ghost water type. It's simple, but I, I do like it. Not gonna use it, but it's not bad. Holy fuck, he's so sick. He's so goddamn cool. How am I gonna explain this to my wife? I don't have. I don't know why I'm wasting time with Kingler. I'm never gonna use a Kingler on my team. 
But I sometimes just just have to know. Holy fuck, I need to know. Oh my god, did he breathe fire out of his claw mouth? Bro, this game is incredible. Holy fuck. It's just so goddamn good. Is that a regular Dark Cry? <laughs> oh, dude, I just think it's incredible. We have one box of Pokemon. Like, literally, we only have one box of Pokemon and we're spending this much time in here, dude. It's it's fucking stupid. It's actually just fucking stupid. All right, is it is it Hone Edge? So we st here's the exciting thing, though. Typically, we don't have evolutions to look forward to. Because we typically, since we're using a randomizer, we, we take two final forms and we put them together, right? If we do the Mewtwo Hone Edge, we would get to Blade and Aegis Slash's evolution. That's kind of exciting. We, we would have that to look forward to. Dude, why did Hone Edge get so much love? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We're reversing this, don't worry. I want to see both of them. Wow, that sucks. <laughs> I love it. That's a perfect Pokemon to me. I fucking love that one. It probably hits hard, too. It's like a bat dragon butterfly. It's so good. Was Infernape neglected? Did we neglect the Infernape since it was on the other screen? I feel like we we neglected it a bit. You don't get anything. I need to know. <laughs> um, not in love with it, but it's not horrible. I'm almost out of splicers again, man. It's insane how much time we've spent in this PC in the last two hours. Oh wait, I wanted to reverse it. Oh well, you'll never know, chat. Get fucked. Um, we tried that. Fire fighting. Please don't be ugly. God damn it. It's good, don't get me wrong. Not good enough to be on my team good, though. Umbreon, dark fighting type? Got that box, I need to know. Oh, I hate it so much. I just cannot stand that. Infernape and Darkrai, I feel like... It'd be incredible. Oh, that's so good. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's so good, bro. I, do, I don't I do know what to do. Uh, what, what Darkrai do we pick? How can it be so good in one form, but so bad in the other one? Oh, no. I mean, look at this Darkrai Dragonite. So good. Look at this Darkrai Entei. That would be a that would be a Darkrai with a fighting type, which would get rid of the fact that we already have a fight. Oh, I think we benched this. Oh, I hate decisions. I think it's more important we get Mewtwo on the team. Mewtwo Togepi? Say I fucking won't, bro. <laughs> you even got the DNA on it, bro. Okay, so we could use Umbreon. Here, our problem with Umbreon is I don't think we'll ever use him. And here's why. Darkrai is so fucking cool that we're probably always going to have a Darkrai on the team, so we don't need a secondary Dark type. And I think that sucks. It would have to have, like, an insane second typing with it for Umbreon to ever get used, because Darkrai is always going to over, uh, over, uh, proceed it or whatever the term is. Um, so that kind of sucks for him, you know? I think at this point, we just do the Hone Edge Mewtwo and start leveling up our Hone Edge, and this gives us a steel, um, 
a steel psychic type. I think that's pretty exciting. So let's just do that for now, and that way we can actually play the game. Game corner's bad for the city's image. Okay, chat, I think we're gonna call it quits right here, though. Um, I think we had quite a successful session, and we got lots of cool Pokemons again. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, let me do a save job, and we'll take a final look at the team as we move forward to tomorrow's quest of becoming a Pokemon Master. Um, yeah. Take a look. So we have Gen Ross. Also, I might like give some of these guys better custom names at some point. Like Gyarados would pro I mean, uh, Garchampados or something like that, you know? A little better than uh, Gardos. Gardos doesn't work. But yeah, Gardos is pretty cool. Uh, Charlord's a work in progress. Definitely gonna be pulling some Charizard out of him at some point. Uh, Dark Knight kind of looks like shiny Charizard. But that's a dark cry dragonite we have dark tay who's not really on the team anymore but i love him so much he has to sit there and we got han with a really cool battle cry um so we'll make this happen as we play next time